And how long has your husband been acting disloyal? I try not to use such colorful language, my lord, especially in such delicate situations. But in that case, I'll rephrase. How long has your husband been diving ass first into someone else's bed? <laughs> I'm sure there's a healing spell for that, my lord. Any suspects so far? Well, anyone of age who's shown up recently, anyone whose situation has changed for the lonelier recently, anyone with a silver tongue who might hold a grudge against you, anyone with their tongue in your husband's mouth, are any of those ringing a bell? A absolutely, my lord, we can find these things out for you. I just want to make sure we weren't investigating things you already know. I appreciate your time, Lord Spade. My party and I will be staying at the Crow's Teeth Inn should you need to send a message or help us turn copper into beer. I hope you're enjoying the rest of your evening. Whew. That went well. First mystery solved. He's being cucked because he's a jerk. It's a bit late. We can start asking around tomorrow once our hangovers wear off. Because if we start asking about people being unfaithful in the tap room of a tavern, we're going to get nothing but sob stories and drunkards telling us every lewd fantasy they can think of. Hey, look, if you're so keen to hear some lewd stories, I can tell you a few before you go to sleep, okay? Of course I know lewd stories. I have a whole bunch of them in my book. Yes, oh mighty fighter. The stories are on those pages. Now can you give me back my book? I know, I wish you could read too. Hey, Druid, you think you can cast Shilele on my special friend again tonight? Okay, what do we have here? Good evening, yes, we are Sly's dogs and I'm Sly. How can we help you? I'm afraid you're mistaken, sir. We're not here to investigate you for cheating on your husband, that would be... Absurd. We're here to get drunk and kill kobolds. No. No kobolds. <sighs> well, <laughs> see, we're doing an amazing job already. We know nothing about any infidelity or personal situations. Sir, we're here to... That's a lot of gold. <sighs> what would you like to know? Your husband suspects you're being unfaithful to him and wants us to find out who the other person is. That is a lot of gold, sir. He plans to duel your new friend to the gold. I mean, to the death. Yes, 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 yes. Duel him to death. I know. Did you see how much gold he just gave us? Hey, 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 sir, it's okay. We're not gonna let your lover die. We're a party that sees every gold I life as precious and would be honor-bound to prevent such a murder. <laughs> I have a twinkle in my eye that'll be a foolproof plan by morning, sir, so you're now protected by Sly's dogs. Why do you lot always come up with plans that suck? Seriously, like? Send the lovers to the Fey Realm? Ambush the Lord? Make them hide in the gazebo? You're all very, very good at what you do, but like... Really? Four adventures who can plant a root in, a root in the brothel? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have a plan. Can someone... Uh, uh, use a spell to copy this, uh... A copy to spell, the spell to copy this parchment about 800 times by tomorrow. Well, well, shh, shh, shh. The plan is, the plan is, see, listen, listen. You lot go find a cave or a basement and start making these heroic noises all day while I sleep. Then tomorrow night, I'm going knock, knock, knock on the doors. I'm... It means I knock on everyone's doors and I give them, I give them, you know, you know what? Just, just, just keep drinking. Just keep drinking. Uh, and leave it to me. I, I am so stressed that you're all going to do something that stops us all from getting that shiny, oh, twinkly, sparkly, mm, chewy gold the Lord's husband offered us.
Are you the master of the house? Message for you. Your eyes only. Don't let anyone else know you're coming. You sure your wife won't miss you for an evening? Come alone and be ready to meet your admirer. Be there at sundown, bring a gift. Flowers will do. Always loved you, said you'd remember her enormous pair. You matched the description she gave me. This is for you. Be discreet, but when the evening bell chimes, step forward for her. She'll be looking for the one who steps forward with the bell. Step forward when the evening bell chimes and she'll know. She'll fuck you. Yes, yes, fuck you. Should I start from the beginning? And that's when she'll know you're serious about her affections. <sighs> Isn't the sunset beautiful? No, I meant in general. I can't see anything this deep into the town. Is this where normal people do things they're not supposed to? Shady streets that nobody ever comes to? I'm a bard. I don't sing about people until they've stopped being normal. No, you're not normal. You neck stomp a hobgoblin while... Wait, wait, wait. Here comes his lordship. I mean lordship. Greetings, my lord. This is where we have set the trap for those who would feign to love your husband. Ah, uh, yes, I know the identity of those involved, but it would mean nothing if I didn't provide evidence you can see with your own eyes. See your husband, dressed in his finest. He waits nervously. Wait! Here comes someone now, with flowers. No, 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 wait. They haven't done anything yet, and there may be more to this. See, another approaches with a gift as well. We were wise to wait, for there are two. No, three! A third approaches with a gift, and a fourth! My lord, your husband's lust must know no bounds! I can count eleven suitors all gathering near your husband. <gasps> my god, has your spouse been walking funny lately? No, 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 my lord. They have not yet made direct contact with your husband. Maybe they're waiting for... <gasps> the evening bell. Now they... Um, my lord, is it possible that your husband is cuckolding you with the entire town? It looks more like a secret show of appreciation. Does your husband do any charity work? Does he help around the town? Well, either he's humble and doesn't want to publicly overshadow you, or he has truly overwhelming lust for the taste of... What is it, Whiskey? Oh, I see, yes. Why is he getting up on that raised dais? He's about to point. He, he's pointing. He's condemning his husband in front of a crowd. Oh, whiskey. Folks, it's that time again. Oh, there he is. Run! 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 <laughs> to know he was trying to overthrow his husband. Do we at least have the gold? And then we call this a victory and keep running, keep running, until we can blame someone else. Shh, shh, shh. Go, go, go! We're gonna get fit with all this running.